hi guys welcome back to my channel today I will share to you how to fix iPhone 8 plus that won't boot on sebelum kita teruskan lebih lanjut kepada yang belum subscribe subscribe dulu terima kasih so when I hit the power button it's not working when I plug to the charger it's not charging and when I plug to iTunes it says USB not recognized so now we're gonna remove the screen and find out what is happening with this phone the first thing we're gonna do is to remove or disconnect the battery connector make sure we disconnect the battery okay now the display connector the fingerprint connector <coughs> another one is sensor ribbon connector Normally, the first thing I will do is to check with uh, power supply with short detection. So now I will connect the black probe to the ground. This is power supply with short detection. So when I place to the battery negative, they will go beep sound. It's normal. And when I touch to positive, there's a beep sound as well. So now we know that this phone is shorted to the ground. One more thing, I will check the charging voltage. Normally, when we have something shorted to the ground, we're not gonna have the charging voltage. So now we confirm. We have 0 0.003 on charging voltage. So this phone is dead. <coughs> what I'm gonna do now is to take out the main board and we're gonna need pets diagram so this is the main board so now we open our pets diagram iPhone 8 Plus so we gonna look for VDD main <coughs> okay this is VDD main we can see the red component is all in the VDD main line so one of this component are shorted to the ground we're gonna need rosin <coughs> very very basic way to find short just using the rosin so we only need the smoke of the rosin so we're gonna place it all to the VDD main line and the rosin actually will melt when we inject some voltage so now I'm gonna inject uh, 4 volt 
using 5 amp power supply and we gonna find out where is the shot yeah we have we have the component now let's see see there's a short capacitor on the VDD main line so now I'm gonna remove the capacitor normally I will put some solder on the capacitor so gonna make me easier easier to remove alright just bring it down okay I think we fix we fix this problem already so now we need to clean the board just check the battery connector no more short so now we're gonna check the charging voltage Yeah, we have 4.3 volt on charging voltage. It's normal. It's back to life. It's gonna back to life. Chante. <coughs> now, I'm gonna put back the LCD and try to boot on. Yeah, Apple logo. Wait until yeah, back to life again. So, thank you for watching, guys. The phone back to normal. So it's very basic repair, very very easy. So. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again next time. Bye.